Right now, Casey's playing his dumbass song that he loves so much. <laughs> Song. Merry Christmas, Effie. Uh, hey, what's up, Effie? This is Ahoda. I'm here to do my Secret Santa stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joined here today by my brother, Herb's brother. How you doing? <laughs> okay, so I am opening my Secret Santa present. Thank you so much, Santa. Obviously, you can see that it is. See, uh, I moved since last time, so here's an apartment tour. Ooh. Um. Oh, gee, I'm dizzy. Um, okay. Very appropriate that I'm doing this today as it is officially, just as of now, December 25th. Since I am a graveyard worker, I am just waking up, and I woke up to some wonderful presents under my doorstep. So... So, I think my secret Santa might have secretly wanted me to see me struggle this year. Because they got me two of the exact same kinds of tubes that uh, almost killed me last year. Yeah, it says it's from my secret Santa. Um, so, you know, no mix-up. I'm having all my packages sent to California anyway, so there was no risk of that. So, two packages. Uh, this one came first, unfortunately. Um, you know. I think I know the theme. That's okay. Herb's wife opened up. Two of the gifts already. They were in one box. We were looking for two boxes. They were actually both in one box. So this is where you get Taboo, which we played all weekend. You can't go wrong with Taboo. Don't know why he's talking. And uh, Barbera da Alba, which is, we'll open it. Open the box, my lovely assistant. We have a nice little clothing package here. Now just feeling this. I have a pretty good feeling I know what this is because I've got it in a previous Secret Santa. And we got this heavy bastard, which um, Santa Claus is very nice and decided to make it easy to open since it's been damaged by water. <laughs> <laughs> a book. The Gray Man, a series that I've been wanting to try out. Oh, oh looks like someone's going to have to learn how to read. R-E-A-D, read. <laughs> All right, moving right along. Casey, I will not be in your fail montage of people trying to open packages. This is a success story. Here we go. The new year, new me. All right, I'm opening my Christmas present. Let's see, let's see. Hope I didn't damage any. Holy shit! Oh, this is all wrapped and stuff. Oh my goodness. So we still have two packages left. Do you want to open one? Yeah. Top, they're my gifts. All right. I smelled what the rock was cooking that time. Is that a Magnum? Mm-hmm. So, look at that lovely bottle of Italian wine. It looks really good. And the lady at the wine store said it was a really good bottle. And then... Are you going to open it? Yeah, but... Also... Let's see what the first thing is. Ooh, it's a San Francisco Giants badge holder. Because somebody knows I have a badge that I take to work every day. That's so cute. Thank you. Got to put that uh, to my badge in there. I won't be showing you guys my badge because that is bad operational security. So first gift is the What Do You Mean game as well as the What Do You Mean expansion pack. Not safe for work. Good stuff. This paper. Moulin Rouge. Tickets on sale. Mean Girls. Beetlejuice. Frozen. Good, Casey. This one's for you. Mormon. Uh, 
Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. So. Sticky hands. Ooh. I'm gonna bring these to the office to annoy the shit out of people at work. Jeff Langevin, Art and Design. Hmm. Say, a gift for you enjoy from Curtis. Well, I guess there goes that review. Yes, another wig. That's my collection. Now that is the second wig that I own. Although I have to say, this one looks a lot fancier than the one that Curtis sent me. There. Aha. Okay. Sweet. See what happened in the news, the disappearance of Buck White. He's missing. Note the date. Today is, what the fuck's today? I don't know. But um, ho hopefully by the time you're watching this video, Buck White has been found. All right, get out of here. <laughs> Let's open this bad boy up. Um, Secret Hitler board game, which is really, really fun. Um, I'm going to have to make the decision of whether to lug this out to California with me so my family and I can play it this year. Um, yeah, I'll have to see how much room I have in my suitcase because that'd be really fun. But my friends and I love to play this, so, um, yeah. You guys mostly all know what this is because I think we've, I may have played it online with some of you before, so. Fun! But because I picked it up, I got a little credit, and I got this bottle of wine, too. So Walla thank you so Walla. much. It's Walla Walla, Seven Hills. Yeah. This is a great gift. This is the ultimate Nintendo guide to the Super Nintendo library. So I actually have already another one of these. I have this one, which is guide to the NES library. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mrs. Doubtfire, the musical. Okay, let's get to the present. Coasters? Curb coasters? Oh man. That's pretty neat. Got a 2001 Space Odyssey. Piece of a wall art. It's very cool. This is sick. <laughs> yes, a giant tumbler. This is awesome. Uh, this is one of my favorite coffee table books. And it, it basically it goes down every single game in the super in the in the original Nintendo library. It rates it, gives some screenshots, and there's a paragraph for every single game. Every single game in the library, from Bubble Babes to Super Mario Bros. to uh, Tag and Dragon, Action 52, you know, all the classics. Yes. <laughs> I was gonna make this joke when I saw it was a coaster, I should have figured that's what it is. I do respect wood. <laughs> These are great. That's my boy LD. These are coasters, which are always handy. I love these. I love this. I'm going to keep this package. Look at him. And uh, Lucy's really excited about it. 
And so is Charlie. <laughs> Aren't you guys so excited? Yes. And they have their Christmas sweaters on. I'm just going to kind of flick through this a little bit. And it, it's the same style. It's got the, the art, the screenshots, uh, the paragraph here about it, the reflections. Uh, really, really cool. Thanks for respecting wood. <laughs> Whose handwriting is that? Hmm? Hmm? I think it was probably made by um, my Secret Santa's children, who I have met a few times, and also, you know, spoil anything. Accessories that you can read about which I had none of, actually. I think the only accessory I had, I had the Mario Paint mouse, because I had Mario Paint. But I never had a Zapper. I never had a Game Genie. I definitely didn't have the Entertainment System Life Cycle. Dark Waters, Two Popes. I haven't seen either of those two movies yet. It's supposed to be pretty good. Apparently this is a perfect film. Irishman, disappointing, slightly. John Adams. No, no, no. Oh, God. Okay, yeah. Side. Show it to the camera. Um, ooh! Mini Rubik's Cubes, which will also be going on my desk at work. Okay, I'm heavy. I know, it's huge. Okay, I'm gonna do a little taste. Got all those retro ads. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Just got lynched in Mafia a couple minutes ago. What can you do, you know? It happens. Not to me that often, but this time it did. It's a bib. Oh my goodness. Ah, ha ha. Okay, the, there's a giant lanyard to match the badge holder. This is going to be great when I am uh, also traveling down to court and have to put something on my badge. Awesome. So I'm definitely going to be slipping through this probably pretty much the rest of the day. Uh, since it is the middle of the night, I'm probably going to read a good chunk of this right now. Keep your gift a surprise. Unwrap your present before opening this envelope. This seems to be empty, though. Yes, this is D&D &D related stuff, which is fantastic. This is uh, something I'm about to get into. Actually, I'll show you some shit over there. Oh, wow. Oh my God, yes, pens. Um, the government will not pay, like they pay for our supplies, but not really at work. So half the time I have to buy my own supplies and my pens always get stolen. So I'm very excited about this. And there are probably not too many people at work who want Giants pens besides me. So uh, my boss is a Yankees fan, so he certainly will not be stealing these pens. Um, so that is great. Jesus, look at this. <laughs> look at this rap job. Uh, this has got to be a D&D &D book. It has to be. A gift for you. I don't need this fucking bib anymore. Merry Christmas from your Secret Santa. This is... The, if this isn't Maddie... Like, who is this going to be? Fucking Ahoda? Yeah, right. 
does not know how to tie a goddamn bow. It's looking like a bio shock and really nice oh god the next gift is a little michigan bluetooth speaker pretty sweet i like the idea can't wait to use it i got a crisp a mug oh sorry sorry camera cute okay yes yeah, like yes it. yes i'll be taking that home with me oh and Darth Maul. Oh my god. What? If these walls could talk. Stories from the San Francisco Giants dugout locker room and press box by Chris Haft. This is awesome. Oh my god. I can't wait to read this. That's so cool. I hate the off season so much because I just go through baseball withdrawal. So, oh my God. And the forwards are by Mike Kruko and Brandon Crawford. That's amazing. Perfect. So we are back. Let's see. What's it gonna be? Yes. It's straight. Here it is. That's awesome. Thanks, Curtis. A not so secret Santa. Merry Christmas, primate. Which is fitting because we just went to go see Star Wars. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. And Raj, I have a surprise for you since I got two shirts for Christmas. This is good. Tell me what you think. It's good. Yeah, it is good. Good choice, Secret Santa. This is what I want. This is the D&D Monster Manual, which is super cool. Uh, these guys help me out a lot. So I put a bunch of D&D &D stuff on my uh, wish list. I've never played in person before. Um, and I got some tea. The next gift is the Detroit Tigers mascot Funko Pop. His name is Paws. My kids have already stolen it and hid it from me a few times because they want it. Um, thank you so much. This is an awesome gift. I was not expecting my Secret Santa to actually get this. Um, and I was planning on getting it as soon as Secret Santa was over. Just in case they didn't. So I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much. What is this? It's a lot lighter, significantly. Sedaris book. I have not heard of this one, but judging from the cover, it looks hilarious. Because I'm making crafty stuff for D&D. &D. See all that shit? See all this shit? It's fun. And this shit that Secret Santa just bought me is going to make it even more fun. So thank you, Santa. I am going to allow you... <laughs> To watch me wear both of them. <laughs> and cup to drink it out of. Santa, you are wonderful. This is so kind. This is the longest video. I'm so sorry, Casey. Ah! Yes. Oh my god. Okay, so this is Sherry Brown's new book, Dusk 88. Um, no one gives a shit about this except me, but uh, he's like my favorite senator ever. And um he wrote a book about all of the previous progressive senators who have sat at the desk that he sits at on the Senate floor. Um, so he worked really hard on this book and I'm super excited to read it. But um, these are great gifts. Look at these little guys. So fun. It works. And this is probably my best and favorite gift from the Secret Santa is my own personal Dundee Award. And uh, that's Michael Scott in the background. 
Cheers. <laughs> Thank you so much. Merry Christmas. Thank you, Secret Santa. I really, really appreciate it. And of course, I love the gifts that I will be wearing. Thank you. It's Christmas time. Ho, 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 it's Christmas time. Ho, 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 it's Christmas time. Santa's on his way. Merry Christmas. Okay, well, Merry Christmas. Thank you again. Yeah, that's great. Oh my gosh, Santa, you are too kind. And I hope you have a great Christmas. I hope everyone else has a great Christmas. And looking forward to doing this again. Thanks. Merry Christmas, and thank you for this, thank you for all of it, great gifts, um, that's it, bye. So thank you very much, Yuki Sandy, you did a great job, awesome stuff, catch you guys later.